Hey guys, it's me, Nick, known as One Up Films. I haven't criticized or rant Switch played in a while, and I want to make this my last and final rant on him. I want to remake all three of my previous criticisms and rants on Switch played in one video. Which is why I'm making a fourth one right now. Because honestly, I wasn't too proud of those criticism videos because they were unscripted. But this time, this is going to be scripted and I planned this out better than the previous ones. We all know Switch played. He's just nothing but a homophobe, a body shamer, a Trump bootlicker, a fake Nintendo fan, and he is known as the pronoun guy. Everything that perfectly describes this broken record of a man. I have talked and criticized Switch played before for months now, and I want this to be my last criticism video about him. Because there are some things that I really want to call him out on his actions, and I just cannot let him get away with this. I want to call out this toxic man-child that makes a big deal out of pronouns like he thinks they are going to affect his life or something. Him and Heels vs. Babyface would definitely get along with each other. They seem to be more like brothers at this point. If you aren't familiar with Switch Played and every foolish thing he's ever done, He's known for being the biggest bigot that's made a whole entire video over the new voice actor of Mario having pronouns in his bio. And after he made a big deal out of it, people have called him out and clowned him for it. So now he accused Mario and pronouns of being woke. This is literally what made Switch played the biggest joke and clown on the internet. When people were clowning him for making a big deal out of it, he decided to call them pronoun cultist. <laughs> Bitch, what? I'm sorry about that, guys. I, I just had to let that all out. The amount of stupidity within Switch played cannot be this real. Oh man, it literally cracks me up whenever Switch played is so desperate to be proven right. He has proven himself even more wrong than usual. Not only Switch played just contradicted himself, he has made a complete ass of himself. He even stated and said he doesn't know anything about the new voice actor, Kevin Afghani. Now this is not 100% confirmed yet, but it would appear that the new voice actor for Mario is none other than Kevin Afghani. And I don't really know what this dude has done, I'm not familiar with his other works, and I've never even heard of him before until just a few minutes ago. Yeah, that's right. He directly said that he doesn't know anything about him, but he still made a video about him and made a big deal out of it. Okay, Switch played. If you don't know anything about Kevin, then why even make a video of him if you don't even know anything about him? That doesn't make any goddamn sense at all. Like seriously, where is your logic switch played? Oh, that's right, silly me. I forgot. Switch played is one of those political ass wipes that don't even know what the term woke even means. So he decided to use the term as a gimmick for his own benefits. Just like any other dumbass anti woke commenters out there on YouTube. And yes, I do know what the term woke really means. 
It's thanks to actual good people with brain cells that gave me the info about it and even Google is a blessing to tell me this as well. But I will save that for my next criticism video on the entire anti-woke community. But still, if none of you anti-woke dumbasses know what the term even means, Google it. I just really cannot wait to actually criticize the entire anti-woke community one of these days. That will definitely be my next criticism video that I'm going to do. And I'm not going to hold back from anything on them, just so you guys know. So anyway, after Switch played meltdown over pronouns, he wants to force Nintendo to bring back Charles Martinet. Okay, there are a lot of delusional takes that Switch Played has said that has proven he's a fake Nintendo fan. Cause one, Mario is tolerant and sees the face of value to anyone. And two, Charles Martinet actually respects gays and equality. So if Switch Played would be a real Nintendo fan, he would have known about this and he wouldn't be throwing a tantrum or having a meltdown over everything. This is exactly why people call him the pronoun guy. Switch played, he has been avoiding people's criticisms and everyone that's been trying to reason with him because of how much he has made himself a fool. And he is proving them even more that he is just a toxic, egotistic jagoff that thinks he's always right about everything. Like seriously, Switch played. You are making yourself look bad even more right here. Just take the L and admit that you are wrong. Because this is what an egotistic coward does. You're too afraid to admit that you're wrong. That you're trying to bubble yourself away from the criticisms and people that are trying to reason with you and criticize you and call you out on your stupid behavior. Just like me right now. I'm literally calling you out on your stupid behavior. Because stupid people like you needs to learn that you cannot be always right about everything. Hell, I even admit that sometimes I'm wrong about some stuff. But when do you switch played? When do you admit when you're wrong? To make this worse, switch played has proven he doesn't respect people that are non-binary or people's identity and life choices. <laughs> so yeah, wow. Way to show your loyalty to Charles Martin at Switch Played. Way to go. Honestly, it is for the best for Switch Played to leave Twitter and the Nintendo community. Because all he has done is act like a control freak and thinks he could do whatever he wants. Like, bro, you don't own Nintendo and you are not a god to everyone. So for the love of God, Switch Played, please stop already. You even complain about people having pronouns in their bios, having shitty opinions, and their opinions are irrelevant. Has your delusional ass has been looking into a mirror lately? Because this feels like projection right here. You can't even admit that any of your actual opinions are unvalid. Like, do you see the reason why you're being clowned and called out? But no, you decided to accuse them of being pronoun cultists for no reason. Switch played. If you're not seeing the real reason why people are clowning and making fun of you because of how much of a careless asshole you are, then maybe you shouldn't be on the internet at all. You insult your critics and including me, just because you refuse to take the L. 
Only the bigger person that admits their wrongs and mistakes deserve a W. Because you've been getting L's after L's after L's non-stop. Because you Switch played, you aren't the bigger person here. You give Nintendo a bad name, and you're an insult to Mario, and Charles Martin would be ashamed of you. You are an absolute disgrace, Switch played. Grow some goddamn sense in your thick skull already, and take some fucking responsibility for your actions. So no matter what you call it, Switch played, this isn't pride. This is just your ego talking. You're a delusional bigot that is making a complete fool out of yourself because of all the shitty takes you have said. You don't even know what pride is since you are a homophobic dimwit that is afraid of a rainbow flag. So again, Charles Martinet, he has more pride than you. And Nintendo is not going to listen to your man-child ass. I hate pronouns, and I want them no longer to exist in this world. Oh, just shut up, Switchblade. This is why people are asking you to delete your Twitter account. You made a complete fool out of yourself, and you made a big deal out of nothing. And you have no respect for others that you insult them for no reason like a crybaby cringe lord, you are. You literally go through all of this effort just because people have pronouns in their bios. I have a few words for you, Switchblade. Grow the fuck up. You haven't improved as a person at all. You're a little grown ass man that is having a meltdown over pronouns. If you want to act like an adult Switch played, then fucking act like it. And another thing I want to add is, Switch played said that pronouns are a communist language. Someone responded by saying a pronoun person is just a human being. Buddy, I'm not arguing against their existence as people. Of course they're human beings. You're just muddying the water here. What I'm against is using this commie newspeak to further alienate the younger generations from their own identities. <sighs> of course he's those type of redneck Republican conspiracy theorist stereotypes. Like how they think that the Earth is flat, and thinks the government are aliens, and thinks that Osama Bin Laden is still alive. Cause that's how ridiculously delusional that sounds. This just Switch played throwing his own conspiracy theories into this to back him up. Switchblade is like the boy who cried wolf, but instead he's the boy who cried communist. The amount of false accusations and jumping into conclusions makes me wonder why he even has subscribers in the first place. Cause seriously, pronouns are not that serious and deep, okay? There are worse things happening out there than just pronouns. There are people that are zoniest and pedophiles and Nazis. But nope, Switch Play doesn't want to focus on that. He rather wastes his time and focus on pronouns instead. <sighs> Seriously, again, pronouns are not that deep. They're just a new way to express your identity and a new way to show your gender. They are just simple words and bios and descriptions and nothing more. But Switchblade, he still makes a big deal out of it just like those complete anti-woke dickheads. So yeah, this is definitely the type of person Switchblade is. He is a toxic, egotistic bigot that has no respect for others, and he is the fakest Nintendo fan ever. Switchblade is better off just deleting his Twitter account and just never touch any political subjects ever again. And he needs to leave people with pronouns alone.
They ain't causing harm to anybody. So Switchblade should mind his own damn business and stop shoving so many sticks up his ass all at once. If not, he could shove this Biden bobblehead down his throat and leave the internet for all I care. Because Switchblade should not be on the internet at all. This man is immature for his age. He is acting like an absolute incel and insulting people just because they have pronouns in their bio. And he's making too much of a big deal out of it. Meanwhile, Charles Martinet, he doesn't make a big deal out of it. Do you see him complaining about it? No, I don't think so. Which is what makes Charles Martinet the most beloved voice actor of all time. Not only that he is the voice of Mario and he has touched many people's hearts during their childhood, he is a man that respects people and he knows the value of equality. But when do you switch plate? When do you see the value of equality or respect people's life decisions and for their identities? Oh, I know. None. I cannot name one thing that you respect people's choices and even their, their genders or their identities. You just lash out at people with pronouns just because you probably don't understand it at all. Just like you don't even understand the goddamn term woke at all. You and the rest of the dickbag anti-woke commenters and community could go fuck yourselves for all I care. Because you all are acting like goddamn man-children at this point. You all are grown-ass adults that are throwing tantrums and meltdowns and making a big deal out of all of this. Ooh, I don't like any woke in my video games or my TV shows. So yeah, stop the woke. Like seriously, shut the hell up. You are making yourselves look bad even more that people are not going to take you seriously. No one's going to give a shit what about you think. No one's going to give a shit what you're going to do at all. And no one is looking forward to the type of shit you're going to say or do at all. Because you're making yourselves look like a bunch of assholes. So it's time to give it all a rest for all I care. Because this shit is stupid as hell. This is why I'm definitely looking forward to ranting and criticizing the entire anti-woke community. And call them out for their bullcrap. And finally, hopefully one of these days... These anti-woke, dimwit morons can finally be put to a stop. Because morons like these shouldn't even be the voice of children or the next generation at all. These people are an absolute disgrace. <sighs> so, yeah. That's just basically what I think about this whole entire situation with Switch played and him being the most fakest Nintendo fan of all time. Yeah, honestly, Switchblade, he needs to leave the Nintendo community immediately. Because the anti-woke community, it's more of his thing. Because he is just like those, those goddamn bigots and neckbeards and incels over there. And I'm definitely looking forward to criticizing and ranting on the anti-woke community. And definitely calling out on the anti-woke commenters as well. It would definitely be fun to mock them and make fun of them for the type of people they are. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and basically, yeah, I am going to be working on some other video someday. I am working on three videos. I have planned on making three videos, three normal videos that I want to work on, but they're going to be a little surprise. So yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and basically, yeah, please show your love and support. And basically, yeah, if you want me to make more videos like this, please consider subscribing and leaving a like, because it would definitely help out a lot. And also, please go support my fundraiser to helping me make my own video game, because I really want to work on a video game so badly, and this is a video game that's going to be 
against corporate greed. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll definitely see you guys next time and goodbye.